I love nightlife in Seoul. There's so many things open so late. There's great things to eat, there's great shopping, and furthermore, there's so many people out that the atmosphere is awesome at night. But of course, what would a night out be complete without getting a little bit crazy at the club? So let's get started. The first thing I'm gonna do is use a little bit of facial mist because it's been all day and my face is getting a little bit dry. But in terms of the base makeup and stuff, it's the same one I use in the other videos. So I'm just gonna skip that and go right to the eyes. <laughs> so first I'm gonna take the color Half Baked and just put it all over my eyelids. Or you can use any type of light gold color you want. And then I'm gonna take this like medium color red with lots of shinies and just put it on my crease. And then what I want to do is make sure it goes over my crease a little bit so that way when my eye is open, you know, you can still see it like a little bit of peekaboo, you know. So that's why I'm putting it up a little bit higher right now. And then I'm going to take a darker version of that red color and just put it in the crease and on the outer edges of it a little bit. So it kind of has like a gradient effect, like it's darker on the outside, lighter on the inside, you know. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And then just taking that medium red color and putting it on my bottom lid. You could essentially do that in the first step, but you know, I just like to make things complicated. And then I'm just gonna take a glittery stick or you can use any type of glittery shadow you want and put it in the inner corners. And you could actually use gold if you want, but for some reason I decided I wanted to use a white one. And then I'm gonna take a color, not black, but kind of like a grayish, it's busted from the Naked palette and put it on the very middle part of the crease. So it's kind of has like a little darker line in it. And then I'm going to line my bottom waterline with a black pencil. And then I'm going to take a pen lighter and make a wing out. You can make the wing whatever way you like. Today I wanted it to be a little bit up but a little bit down. I don't know how to describe it. It's up to you. I think the wing shape that you use depends on the shape of your eye and how you like it. But this is how I like mine. So this is how I did mine. Time for the false eyelashes, just slap them on real good. I love these eyelashes from Etude House. I think that they look really good with this makeup. And then I'm just gonna put some mascara on the bottom lashes first and the top lashes second because it's a little bit easier that way. And that's it for the eye makeup. So the next series of clips were filmed out of focus. The cameraman was not paying attention, sir. <laughs> so I'm just gonna contour my cheeks a little bit and add a little bit of blush on them, not too much. And I'm gonna use a reddish burgundy pencil that I think matches well with the eyeshadow look. So that's the completed look, yay. And the dress that I'm wearing, it's the same dress from my most recent fashion and dance video called Hot Long Sleeve Korean Dresses. So if you want to see more dresses like this one, then check that video out. But it's super comfy, stretchy, and a little bit breathable. Thank you so much for watching this video. This video was sponsored by JD Sound, the maker of Monsters Go DJ, which is a portable DJ device which can be used professionally or in your home. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video and you'd like to see more videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is down below. Don't forget you can follow me on Instagram and Twitter and like me on Facebook. And I will see ya! <laughs>